Hello and welcome to Mount Calvary Lutheran Church. We are so excited you could join us this evening for our first ever virtual concert. If you enjoy your time tonight, be on the lookout for our next virtual concert on Friday, October 23rd at 6 p.m. You are in for some incredible music, including artists the Daisy Dillman Band, Al Jordan, and Rachel Kurtz, to name just a few. All music videos you will see tonight were featured in our summer services, which you can go back and watch at mountcalvary.org worship. Before we get started with our first song, comment on the sidebar and let us know who's all out there watching. Our first song tonight comes from a beloved group by the Excelsior community, featured in a worship service where Pastor Dave preached a sermon titled, Teach Your Children Well. To open us up tonight, please welcome the Daisy Dillman Band singing Teach Your Children Well by Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young. Thank you. 
I'm here with my good friend Carol McMullen from the Mount Calvary Bell Choir. Hi Carol. Hi Mark. Carol, could you give us some background information on the piece we play, Aquarius Let the Sun Shine In, and the significance of the musical it comes from, Hair? Well, in April of 1968, Martin Luther King Jr. was tragically assassinated at the Lorraine Motel in Memphis, Tennessee. In that same year, and actually the same month, at the height of the Civil Rights Movement, the musical opened on Broadway called Hair. This musical was groundbreaking in several ways, but most importantly in how it opened the art form of musical theater to racial integration. Hair was the first stage musical where fully one third of the cast was black and the roles offered were as leads not roles portraying slaves or servants as they had b traditionally been in many other stage and film productions. Aquarius, Let the Sunshine In, is the opening group number from Hair. The lyrics talk about the dawning of an age that will usher in peace, love, understanding, harmony, trust, no more falsehoods and divisions. It is an inspiring piece that holds a message just as relevant today as it was in 1968 when it first premiered. Wow, that is some pretty incredible history. Um, so what does that, what does the song personally mean for you? I remember um, when the song and the play um, came out. I was a junior in high school and it was just a real freeing song. and, f and a song full of enlightenment. And to me, it just meant the world needs more peace, love, and happiness. And that is a motto I've carried through to my children. I always say, oh, we just got to remember peace, love, and happiness. And especially today, right now, our world doesn't have a lot of peace, love, and happiness. And that's what the song means to me. And we're still working on it. Yeah. Well, thanks, Carol. Thank you, Mark. You say you see no hope. You say you see no reason we should dream that the world would ever change. You're saying love is foolish to believe. There'll always be some crazy With an army or a knife To wake you from your daydream Put the fear back in your life Look, if someone wrote a play Just to glorify what's stronger than hate Would they not arrange the stage
myself Pat Frederick, local legend, Excelsior native, Minnesota Music Award winner. True. Grammy nominee, Tony Award winner. Uh, me. Welcome. We're glad to have you. Thank you. And thank you for being a part of our uh, music ministry here at Mount Calvary. Tell me a little bit about how you got your start in music. Um, that's a big question, but... You know, I, I grew up just a few blocks from here, and I was a drummer. I was a drummer in my first band. I've played music my whole life. I was seven years old. I heard that out on Gideon's Bay, in the middle of the bay, was a, a, a huge boat, and there were rock bands out there. So I got in my grandfather's rowboat, and I did this out to the boat, and Clunk, I looked up on the second story of this huge boat was Stephen Stills no kidding. standing there. Of Crosby, Stills, of Nash Crosby, and Young. Of Crosby, Stills, Nash and Young. And for you kids, that's not a law firm. And I looked up and there was Stephen Stills and on this boat was the original Buffalo Springfield, the original Jefferson Airplane. I've heard of these groups. Yes. And I'm fairly young. Google these. Okay. And Shadows of Night. G-L-O-R-I, Gloria. G-L-O-R-I, Gloria. And I was a drummer going to rehearsal at the Lee's house to play, to practice that very song. And I looked up and I said, Stephen, uh, can I bum a smoke? <laughs> Wow, this sounds a lot like the Transfiguration story. Yeah. I, I, yeah. You were transfigured. I was transfigured. He threw me down a Viceroy. Mm -hmm. We fired it up. I had a cigarette with Stephen Stills at 11 years old, uh, right in the middle of Gideon's Bay. And then I said, <laughs> I've, I've got to go uh, have a music career. And, uh, from, and, that, and it was all uphill from there. Well, Pat, I love working with you. I'm so glad you're here at Mount Calvary. I had the pleasure of recording a little tune with you, What a Wonderful World. What do you like about What a Wonderful World? Or what, you know, that song is iconic. And we kind of did a cool, cool take on that, What a Wonderful World, cool arrangement. But what, what, is, what is it about that song that is so special? Mark and I are very close. As you know, I, I, I'm a professional melancholic. Melancholic. That's a great word. Yeah, thank you. And that song, I think, especially the way we did it, had a little bit of melancholy to it. Yeah. But the tension with it was that it's essentially a really beautiful, almost childlike lyric. Mm -hmm. And that's what I think resonates with me and with people in that song, is it, it just captures a little snippet of that moment that sometimes harkens back to childhood that we rarely get as adults where we just look out and go, wow, yeah. wow, yeah. life is wonderful. But in this time that we are in, the arrangement that you found and that we did had a little bit of, a little bit of melancholy to it, a little bit of almost like reminding ourselves that it's a wonderful world. Yeah, like we and have to keep it. I loved it. Yeah, I loved yeah. it. Well yeah. said. Well said. Thank you. 
So Pat, other than the fact that um, you get to come to Mount Calvary and work with a guy like me, <laughs> and the free bread and wine we give you every week, um, what, what do you like about coming to Mount Calvary and being a part of the music community here? This place is perfectly home to me. What can I say? You know, the first few times that I was invited, thank you, to play here, it was like kind of like, really, for me, uh, just a breath of fresh air. And to hear the pastors talk hmm. on a daily basis, the intelligence, the humor, the joy, truly, of going about God's work. And, and then just the community and the service, just the humble, joyful service that's bubbling along. It was just like, okay. I, 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 I loved uh, just the, you know, the, the vibe here. Mm -hmm. And with you at the helm, it's always madness mm -hmm. and creativity. And, you know, it's such an inclusive, wonderful, joyful place as a musician. And I think for anybody who comes here, that, that ability to kind of relax about, you know, the rules and regs, if I could, yeah. and, and just be in spirit, uh, you know, just felt at home to me. I love that. Well, thank you. And you, you heard it here first, folks. Come join the Mount Calvary Magical Madness Tour. Right? The Magical and stay tuned. Madness Tour. Pat and I are going to record another song. Uh, what the world needs now is love, love sweet, sweet love. love. Oh, yeah. Coming soon. Yeah. To a digital service near you. Thank you. Thank you. We may not yet have reached our glory. But I will gladly join the fight And when our children share their story They'll tell the story of tonight They'll tell the story of tonight there have you ever felt forgotten in the middle of nowhere have you ever felt like you could disappear like you could fall no one would hear well let that lonely feeling wash away
Before we get to our final songs, we'd like to take this time to point out that we couldn't create these music videos without your financial support. Please take this time to click the button on your screen and the link in the video and donate now. Every contribution is greatly appreciated. We'll play one of our Pass the Plate videos next to give you time to donate, followed by Be a Light, performed by Pat Frederick, Mary Patterson, and members of our Saturday Night Band. Full of doubt, just believe. Yeah, there ain't that much different between you and me. A time full of woe be peace. In a world full of hate, be a light. When you do somebody wrong, make it right. Don't hide in the dark, you were born to shine. World full of hate, be a light. La 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 la. In a place that needs change, make a difference. In a time full of noise, just listen. Cause life is but a breeze, better live it. In a place that needs a change, make a difference, Lord. In a world full of hate. When you do somebody wrong, make it right Oh, don't hide in the dark, you were born to shine In a world full of hate, be a light La 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 In a race you can't win, slow it down. Yeah, you only get one go around. Cause the finish line is six feet in the ground. In a race you can't win, just slow it down. In a world full of hate, be alive. When you do somebody wrong, they it right. Don't hide in the dark, you were born to shine. In a world full of light. It's hard to live in color when you just see black and white. In a world full of hate, be alive. Thank you again for coming out for our first ever virtual concert. 
A reminder to tune in with us on Friday, October 23rd at 6 p.m. for our concert next month, featuring the incredible young people we have in our congregation. All the music videos you saw tonight can be found individually on our YouTube channel, and feel free to share this concert video with friends and family, as it will be available to watch whenever you'd like once the premiere has ended. Have a lovely evening, and stay healthy. I'm singing a song called Rise Up. My name is Rachel Kurtz, and this song was written by black people for black people, and we are singing it in honor of black lives, and we believe that black lives matter. Broken down and tired of living life on a merry-go-round, and you can't find the fighter, but I see it in you, so we'll walk it out and move mountains. We gon' walk it out and move. So I'll rise up, I'll rise like the day And I'll rise up, I'll rise unafraid I'll rise up, and I'll do it a thousand times again And I'll rise up, high like the waves And I'll rise up, in spite of the ache I'll rise up, and I'll do it a thousand to breathe and I know you feel like dying but I promise we'll take the world to its feet move mountains take them to their feet move mountains and I'll rise up I'll rise like the day and I'll rise up, I'll rise unafraid, I'll rise up and I'll do it a thousand times again. In spite of the ache, I'll 